So today is daily cyber number 87. Okay, so what have I got going on today? I studied a little bit on the weekend, not as much as I wanted to, but I took a Sunday off and had some fun. Um, friends, uh, family barbecue slash uh, birthday party, so I had some fun there. Uh, what I covered a little bit was uh, 3.0, which is treat uh, threats, treats, thinking of sweets and all that. Um, threats and vulnerabilities, uh, which covered, and the areas that I needed to cover was 3.1, 3.2, 3.4, 3.5, 3.6, and 3.7. I only reviewed 3.1 and 3.2 and 3.4 over the weekend, which is 3.1 is explain types of malware, 3.2 is summarize various types of attacks, and 3.4 is explain types of wireless attacks. So this morning I got to cover 3.5, 3.6, and 3.7. Uh, and what I want to do is get that done this morning and then get into 4.0, which I got to cover, which 4.0 is application, data, and, and host security. And the three areas that are, I'm weak on right there is 4.2, 4.3, and 4.5, uh, which is 4.2 is summarize mobile uh, security concepts and technologies. 4.3 is given a scenario, select the appropriate solution to establish host security. And 4.5 is compare and contrast uh, alternative methods to mitigate security risks in a static environment. I've got two more sections, uh, 5.0, which is access control and identity, identity management, and then 6.0, which is uh, cryptography, which I think I want to dive a little bit more deep in. This is the two areas that I'm weak on, which is uh, 6.2 and 6.3. But I think I'm going to dive a little bit deeper into that one because I'm hoping that will cover, uh, Cryptography will cover D, uh, Triple Des, DES, AES, and those ones which I, I know I'm weak on. But I'm taking my time through this, making sure as I go to each section, I'm narrowing down each time. If there's three areas that I don't know and narrowing it down to two areas, then one area, and then just making sure I know those, those areas that I'm weak on really, really well. And then also I'm going to go through that this week, trying to get that strategy done. And then next week I'm going to start doing more practice tests, global kind of practice tests, uh, macro. So it covers all the areas that, versus these micro areas that I'm covering now, but uh, a kind of more macro tests. So that I'll make sure that I know what I used to know, and now I know what I'm learning now. So that's my goal for that. Other than that, that's really what's going on today. Uh, and most of this week is study, study, study. So as I go through it, I'll cover and explain some of the areas as I go through and just keep you posted on my day and what's going on. So uh, I'm going to get I'm going to get at it and start doing my practice test. So right now it's in the afternoon. Uh, it's around five o'clock, 10 after five. And the power's gone out. Uh, it's kind of bright in the afternoon. So we're fine that way. But uh, it kind of sucks for me because all my studying stuff, sites, everything I was doing is all on the internet and my router is down, modem's down, everything's down because there's no power. So that sucks on my behalf. Uh, so Toronto One is actually working on it. I placed a call, uh, Toronto Hydro, sorry, Toronto Hydro is working on it. Uh, a transformer caught on fire last night and I guess through the repairing they shut down the whole grid so shut me down so it looks like this afternoon is just relaxing and unwinding uh, and maybe going out having some dinner and just chilling so kind of sucks because I really wanted to get a lot more done but I went out I think around like two o'clock one o'clock or two o'clock this afternoon so I've been calling around trying to figure this out see if I could get it I killed out my cell phone so my cell phone's dead too so kind of crazy but the joys of, of uh, life and getting through things so uh, hopefully tomorrow I'll get caught up uh, if not I'll just add an extra day to my studying and uh, keep going and don't stop so I think that's it for my videos I don't know if I'm gonna be able to post this because I have no power uh, to the internet so I won't be able to upload it I'll be able to edit it tonight, I think. I'll be able to do that. But then I won't be able to post it until the internet's back up. So that could be a day or two. So just want to remind you guys, software is hackable. Being connected is vulnerable. I'll see you next video.